Hello everyone. I am Abhishek and you are watching Straight Up by Edex Live. Tamil Nadu is starting to see a spike in COVID-19 cases once again. On Thursday, the state reported 145 new cases marking the second consecutive day that over 100 new cases have been reported. Even though there were no deaths reported, the active case load rose to 711. But what has been the driving factor this time? Tamil Nadu Health Minister Ma Subramanian has attributed this rise in infections to the large number of students returning to Chennai. The state capital reported the maximum number of cases that is 59 with the neighboring district of Chengalpattu close behind with 58 cases. A row was sparked when the health minister pointed to students from North India as the reason for the spike in cases. He went on to say that of the 5600 first year students in hostels at VIT Kelambakkam campus, 80% are from the northern states who returned to campus around May 12 and 13. He later offered a clarification to his controversial statement saying that it was the duty of the government to safeguard students no matter which state they are from. He also informed that 91% of the positive cases were infected with the BA2 variant. Meanwhile, the situation at IIT Madras and Satyasai College is now under control after cases went up to 237 and 74 respectively. Another cluster that is under control now is at Anna University where 23 cases were reported by Monday. Chennai's tally stood at the top with 2.8 positivity percentage and 326 people undergoing treatment. This was followed by Chengalpattu with 2.7% test positivity rate and 261 active cases. What remains to be seen now is how the government responds to curbing the rising COVID-19 tally in Tamil Nadu. That is all for today in this edition of Straight Up. Do stay tuned to edX Live for more updates on education. Like and share this video and leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Stay safe and we will catch you with another edition of Straight Up.